Hello, welcome back to Elden Ring. It's me, A. Prusian, and... Cold Run. And I am going to... Last time I ended up here in the Celia hideout because I got that spell from Master uh, Lutus, maybe was his Lusat. name? Lusat. Lusat, thank you. And I thought that was the end of it, and then you suggested we might as well follow up with Selen just to make sure... Uh, that there's nothing else interesting happening with her, and I think that's a great idea. My apprentice, give me a moment later. I have a favor to ask. Oh, I mean, I oh, I see. Right, this was the request, the and I fulfilled it. Before you is merely a projection. My body lies oh. elsewhere, but the academy shackles prevent it being moved. My body is on the Weeping Peninsula at the southern tip of the Lands Between, imprisoned in the ruins just down from the Church of Marika, past the plain of the Wandering Mausoleum. Yeah. I make the journey to my body. I have something that I can only trust with you. Okay, that makes more sense. I wondered why there were two of her. So she's a. This one's a projection. Hmm. Okay, you know, that would be the wiser option. Um, because this one I asked before. Oh, right. What a place to find Master Lusat. You have my gratitude. This is all your work. I am truly pleased to have you as an apprentice and a kindred spirit. This is a mere token of my thanks. Please take it. I thought the other thing was the follow-up because it was like, oh, you found the this guy and now I have this other errand for you. But it's actually separate, so, mm -hmm. okay. I actually wonder if that request is something I could have gotten from her earlier <laughs> because the Weeping Peninsula is, like, she's acting like I haven't been there or haven't found it and I found it so this long ago. step closer. The bodies of Masters, Azure, and Lusat can be admitted to the Academy. If only I could undo these wretched shackles. Okay, or maybe it is literally a follow-up here. Um, I'll, I'll ask this again just to make sure. Okay. Can you make the I have some? Yes, okay. All right, well, let's, let's go do that. <laughs> yeah. Because I do remember finding her here. Yeah. Now, where was the down? Sorry, I remember there were shenanigans. Stop it, guys. Stop it. Just trying to figure out where the downstairs is. Uh, there it is. There it was. I found it. Ah! Jeez. This would this would be worse if um if that were dealing any real damage to me at all. <laughs> yeah, sixty levels ago this would probably be a problem right now. Yeah, yeah, I would have actually had to clear the place. Now I'm not so concerned. Alright. Hello again. Thank you for coming. These shackles take a toll on us all. There is something I need you to look after. My primal glimstone. A star has fallen, and my fortunes waver. Ah! Jesus, dude, I'm listening <laughs> to her here. Excuse you. Excuse you. Oh, did... I got really scared for a second that, like, they hit her. I know, right? Oh, man. Okay, well... Dudes, really, seriously, go away. I'm trying to have a conversation. <laughs> Was there my apprentice? Oh no. Oh, sorry. Thank you for coming. These shackles take a toll on us all. There is something I need you to look after. My primal glimstone. A star has fallen and my fortunes waver. Someone may come for my life. And so I am trusted with you, myself. Hmm. Okay, well, obviously I will accept it, even if that weren't my only option. But it's surprising. I'm like, 
I thought she would have me free her, but instead she's transferring her self to me in whatever this primal glint stone is. Mm. Okay. What? Okay. Selen's primal glintstone key item. Are you still there, Selen? Thank you, my apprentice. This is my essence. Please treat it with care. Well, luckily for you, I don't drop key items when I die, so <laughs> shouldn't be an issue. What a terrible game design choice that would be. Oh my god. Glintstone from within Selen's body. Seemingly half alive, blood vessels are visible within. In essence, a primal glintstone is a sorcerer's soul. If transplanted into a compatible new body after their original body dies, the sorcerer will rise again. My apprentice, do you find it distasteful? I think it depends on the compatible new body. What that is and where that comes from. Yeah. <laughs> is this a person you're taking over? Is this like a doll? Is it, you know what I mean? Because we know other people who have kind of lived on as dolls. Um, okay, what else you got for me, Selen? Treated with care by apprentice. What you hold is my very being. Okay, that seems Treated to be, yeah. Okay, well, Selen, are you still here? Wonder what the compatible new body is going to be. Uh, she's not here. Okay, next port of call. I don't. I don't think she would have gone back to the academy, but she did mention. She might have because she mentioned taking Lusat and Azor back to the academy. Hmm. Um. I don't know, I'll try this first. I'll take a look at a few places. Wait, it's not like their here. bodies are prepared or something like that. Right? I don't think she'd be here, but this is a safe place to come into. How you doing? Thou art thou now assured of thy want to be born anew? Uh no oh, cosmetics. Oh, I forgot I could change. Wow, I could change all that. Oh, That's so it's like similar to the mirror, I guess. Just yeah, because there's already flavorful. the mirror in Round Table, Table Hold where I can do that. That's interesting. Not alarmed, nor afeared, I would birth thee as a sweeting, fair and fine. Yes, much... Much obliged. Okay, so Speaking if... of that, though, yes. I learned something that apparently about this room. Mm -hmm. I don't know if it's here or just during the fight, but if you look up at the ceiling, is there anything? So apparently during the fight, those like little baby scholars uh -huh. are being coming from those cribs up on the ceiling. Oh, like, creepy. Born and dropping from there. Creepy as fuck. Yeah. 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 That's... No thanks. <laughs> okay, so the other... Places I could check... I could check these other grace points. Um, oh, what are you checking for? To see if Selen is here. Hmm. Uh... Because she talked about bringing those guys back. 
guys up here, but there was somewhere up here was that big, like, globe of something where I got the Azure staff. Yeah. So, again, it's like, I don't know. This might not be anything, but I want to look. Not these assholes. A uh, robe worn by scholars of the Lazuli Conspectus, singular among the greater Rhea Lucaria Academy. These scholars, who sought to master Carrion sorcery, instead learned to see the moon as equal to the stars. This robe in the hue of the full moon signifies their heresy. Ooh. Heretics. That's always interesting. Ah, I knew this guy was trouble. <laughs> okay. So this was the room I was thinking of, but maybe there's nobody here. Okay. Yeah, this was kind of my best guess of, like, where she might possibly bring them. And if they're not here, I don't know. I mean, I'm, I'm going to just check some of these other places that are easy to get to. Yeah, I don't know. I guess I'll just I... kind of move on. I don't know, unless you have any ideas? I can give you a, a general a general nudge in terms of what kind of the goal of this part this of her what she was saying the goal of this next stage is. Yeah, because um, she well she wants a new body, right? Yeah, she's looking for because you have like her essence in a stone, and you and she's looking for like a compatible body to host her. Yeah, I that doesn't help me at all. I don't know where she would get a compatible body. Like... I'll even say that you, when you first were talking about it, you were like, you had the right idea. Oh, the doll. Said... So she could go maybe here. That was an idea. I don't know if that's the idea you mean, but I'm going to check it out. <laughs> okay. Oh, man. And if not here, there is also... Yeah, you're still, you're still very dead. Um his workshop it's hard sometimes to think through the elden ring logic oh yeah we'll just torrent our way down here oh these dolls that was the message oh i was right <laughs> I was right. Yeah. I had the right idea. <laughs> Fantastic. Oh, good. Okay. Transplant primal glenstone. My apprentice. Just how long has it been? Thank you. You've helped me fill a new body once again. And it's truly a gem. Young and full of vigor, a snug fit for my primal glimstone. Better still, I've shed those awful shackles. Finally, I can return to the academy. Okay. To expel the Karian royal family and restore the primeval current. My dear apprentice. I owe this all to you. Yeah, so I knew she wanted to go to the academy, but I wasn't thinking through <laughs> that she didn't have a body yet. Right. Now, but it wasn't you... unreasonable because she could have projected herself like right. somewhere else from the stone. Yeah. But now I'm curious, is she going to like kick out Renala? <laughs> <laughs> like, good luck. Finally, I can return to the academy to expel the Kari and Royal okay. And so now I'm going to try what I tried before. <laughs> I'm going to go back to the academy. And I guess we'll start here again. If I see Cell in here, like, stabbing Renala, then I'll know I found the right place. I, <laughs> does Renala yeah. count as the Carrion royal family? She does, right? That's she, like she does. Can I can I give a one of those extra yes. quest suggestions about places you might not otherwise yes. return to or see? Is to return yeah. to Witchbane ruins. I might be 
Again, oh. I, as with all these things, it might be too late or too early. Or it was... <laughs> sure. Uh, yeah, I can't interact. Hmm. Yeah, it's. Is it supposed so? It's to be one of those something? things where it might be something come. So I won't. I won't say any more. Yeah. Um, okay. It might be something I missed elsewhere. That's okay. Sure. Let's see if she's around here. She might be at the gate, though. Actually, like if she's returning, maybe she's at one of these. You know, I think I may have found what I was missing. By the way. Oh yeah. The the, the questy thing reason that place was empty oh which okay something apparently messed up no it's just a it's one of those where i hmm, it's i think the if if you're looking for the, th the the thing i was looking for is actually in red main castle <laughs> for this well, again it's one of those things i i don't i might have stumbled onto it by luck but like yeah. i don't know how Okay. So. Yeah, and so maybe not. Ne never mind then. Yeah. Um, so huh. that's the last thing I'll. That was the last thing I could think of. So. All right. Why don't you direct me towards where she would be? Outside, outside the outside Renala's room. Like. Okay. So I was on the right track. I just didn't go out. Yeah, and I don't know why you would right because yeah. i was like well she's not here the atmosphere in this room is still cool though it's great oh oh i see oh be summoned to challenge selen but i see this be summoned to assist selen <gasps> oh that's damn cool <laughs> okay so either I help her or I turn against her. And like, are you kidding me? I'm her apprentice. I am going to help her. <laughs> she just wants to take over the academy and do magic that's taboo. And, you know, what else is a good high intellect sorcerer going to do? But support right. those goals. We're fighting Renala again, though. All right. Jaren, bringer of my death. Witch my hunter. So he, this is the person who was going to come kill her. Yeah. Just a school to reflect on your mistakes. Whoa! Holy shit! Excellent. You have a spell to give me. Because I'm just I'm just saying. <laughs> I want that spell. <laughs> what the fuck? Sure. Oh no. Oh, I see. That's who that was. That was the dude with the pants. That's the connection with Redmain, huh? Yeah, because the last thing he did was, like, he was the Radon Festival guy, and then a little while later he thanked you for putting Radon down honorably and was like, I have to go on old business. Mm, right. The Knight Jaren's Breaches. Okay, Jaren preferred a nomadic existence, but after spending time as a guest of the Vicarian Royals, he became the guest commander for General Radon. And for the first time, the restless tumbleweed would be bound by honorable oath. Okay. Um, let's see, anything different? I almost feel a little bad killing this guy. He had a fun outfit. But, uh... He did. Unusually colorful armor, indeed. But also, I'm Selen's apprentice, so starry dude that I met once. Um... A pointed, ragged hood. The hood hides an aged, bearded mask. Jaren served General Radon as guest commander, and they are said to have sworn an oath of honorable death to one another. That was a mask? I guess so. The beard was a mask. <laughs> That's wild. 
that is is Renala gone? Did we actually oust her? <gasps> Selen. We did it. Principal Selen, I guess. <laughs> it's ours now. The Academy, it's ours. Ah, my apprentice. <laughs> You've saved my skin once again. Do you see this? The Queen of Caria is no more. With the bodies of Masters Azure and Dusat returned, the Academy can hone the primeval current. So that we, fallen children of the stars, shall beam with brilliance once again. My apprentice, will you stay with us here at the Academy? Oh, I know it's not possible. You have your own calling to be the next Elden Lord. But do think of me, of your teacher. On the eve of your crowning, you will always be my darling pupil. Rest assured that I, no, the entire Academy will swear allegiance to the new monarch, my apprentice, become Elden Lord. Hell yeah. I, I do feel slightly bad now for uh, killing slash ousting slash obliterating my mother-in-law. But, um, nonetheless, I am actually, I, like, it's, what this feels like is the choice between the stars and the moon, right? And I feel like the Academy has always belonged to the stars until the Carrions came in and kind of converted it to the moon. And we're just going back to our roots here. That's so. right, you're... You're getting rid of the heretics, like uh, that, like those Lazuli <laughs> blasphemers. Yeah, that's right. Okay, what else you got, Selen? Perhaps I'm jumping ahead, but here is a symbol of my allegiance and the Academy's. Oh, okay. Do you recall what once I told you? No. That glimstone is the amber of the cosmos, and sorcery is the study of the stars and the life therein. When you become Elden Lord, please illuminate me. Lay bare the secrets of life which course the Elden Ring. Next time, I will be your student. That's kind of cool, actually. Okay. And that was great, but it... I will notice that it was like a weapon, Selen, and it was not like stars falling from the sky spell. Okay. Ritual blade once presented to Lindell by the Academy of Raya Lucaria to celebrate their newfound peace. Though the weapon is embedded with precious glint stones and features earth tree ornamentation, the undulating blade is symbolic of an ancient ritual. Unique skill, glint stone dart. Um... Skill that builds from the glintstone pebble sorcery. Charge the skill to upgrade it to glintstone dart. Follow up with a strong attack to chain the skill into a lunging thrust. That actually sounds really fun. It does. Oh. That sounds like a very sorcerer Roger. Sorcerer Roger. Yeah. Like that rapier yeah. dashing magic type guy. Yeah. Oh, I can't do it here because it's like a safety zone. Okay, I'll try it in a bit. But okay, Selen. Oh, one last thing. Yes. If you fail to claim your throne, oh no. You can always pay me a visit. Oh, don't fret. Even my dullest pupils will always have a place here. <laughs> <laughs> okay. All right, I've got a backup. That's great. But she's got new spells, or at least this new spell. It's not the spell I wanted. One of the Glintstone Sorceries of the Academy of Raya Lucaria fires twin projectiles that form a spiral as they travel. The sorcery can be cast repeatedly and while in motion. Charging enhances potency. A sorcery of the Corollus Conspectus, the most venerable of the Academy. This was the product of a failed attempt to create a new comet. Interesting. I'm buying it. Okay. Huh. And that's that's really it, huh, what Selen? Is it, my apprentice? Okay. Okay. Yeah, Wait, what if I wanted to use my larval tears and respec? Is that no longer possible? Ooh, I I I I 
did not, this was not the, I did the different, I did the other option, so this is all <laughs> new to me. Well, if so, oh well. <laughs> <laughs> like, kind of seriously, oh well. Yeah. Um, okay. And there may be another place or way that I can do that. I don't remember this. Little... Okay. All right. Well, the thing. Oh. Shit. No. Look. She's back. Wait. Thou. So thou that's. Thou now assured of thy want. Be not. Okay. Annoyed. You're back. Where's. I would birth thee as a sweeting. Fair and Oh, shit. Is Selen now in this ball of faces or something? The witch's oh, glowstone no. stone crown. Oh, no, I can talk to it. Uh, my... Uh, I... Uh... Oh, no! <laughs> <laughs> oh no, Selen! Oh no, you were on top of the world. It was our academy, and then um, now you're now, now you're a head sphere. Okay. Well, they did always call her the Graven Witch, right? They did. They did. Okay. Well, that answers the question about if I can still respect <laughs> Renala is forever. You are just a ball. That's fascinating. Damn. Oh my god! So she, I guess she like got to work trying to go full like primeval get, current. Dive into the primeval current, and she worked fast. It looks like, right? Like maybe this is just the natural end result of that. Oh my god! Okay. You did get a cool new hat though, so that's nice. It, I did. I should look at it. Wow. One of the glintstone crowns bestowed upon Raya Lucaria scholars whose pursuits were deemed worthy increases intelligence and arcane to the detriment of stamina. This gentle-looking crown was granted to a scholar who excelled in her studies, which also merited the title of witch. Interesting. Wow. Okay, so... First, I want to try this... I want to see what these things look like. Okay. Okay, so that's the dart, if I charge it. That's fun. It's really yeah. pretty. Nice and flexible. Yeah. Cool. That's pretty fun. I don't know that I would... I mean, I may run around with it for a while just because, and then I can always switch to my other Sacred Blade one if it's undead stuff. Um, let's see... Oh, I've been hit by that here in yeah. Rylicaria. Nice. I'm curious to see how that does, like how much damage that does or what that's like. Right? And I will try it out at some point. But right now, I want to remember to go back here and look at the remembrance from Rykard because I have not done that yet and I keep forgetting to. That was such a fascinating end to that quest, though, with Selen. Yeah, that was wild. That right, where that she ended last up. Twist at the end. Oh my god. I before you before you uh, reloaded in, like while you were asking, like seriously, does do you lose the chance to right? respect her? I looked it up and it, I saw an article that said. I looked it up quickly and I saw an article that said, yeah, she she comes back. So I just assumed that like. When you saw her and spawned in, I assumed, like, yeah, it's one of those things just for gameplay purposes. They just don't want to get rid of the, the source of respects. Right. But no, that's, like, she... <laughs> she took She has the rune over. of the undying or the rune of rebirth or whatever, and yeah. Selen is just down a the path of the... Yeah, she's down the path of the stars and the people who's... Because, like, the other two sorcerers who studied the primeval current, they're not, like, the in the greatest of... They, they, not in their greatest yeah. position right now, are they? 
Right? And there was already that room that I went to with the crystals, right? And the big head sphere where I first thought Selen yeah. might be. That was where I got Azur's thing. So that was like, we've already seen this is what happens when people study this and delve too deep into it. Damn. Okay. All right. Well, let's see what's up with our remembrance. It, it was even waiting outside her outside the Witchbane ruins was like her future. Yeah. Oh, that ball. Oh, poor thing. Right. Okay, so here is Rikard's new one. Remembrance of the Blasphemous. We've got the blade, which obviously I can't use. And I don't think I would, because that is one of the single most disturbing things I've seen in this entire game. Oh, yeah. It's pretty, it's pretty gross. Okay. Sacred Sword of Rikard, Lord of Blasphemy. Remains of the countless heroes he has devoured writhe upon the surface of this blade. Now they share the same blood, bound together as family. Some HP is restored upon defeating an enemy. Oh, good. It's, that's great. <laughs> Taker's Flames. Raise the sacred sword aloft to set it ablaze with blasphemous flames, then bring it down to fire off a forward blast. The flames steal HP from those they touch. That's pretty cool, actually. Yeah. Nice and thematic for him. Right? Rikard's Rancor. The terrible power of Rikard, Lord of Blasphemy, summons searing spirits that leave a trail of delayed explosions in their wake. These spirits manifest from the Rancor of heroes who met a violent end. The Lord granted them an audience, whereupon they were welcomed by the maw of the Great Serpent, and within the Serpent's bowels they became the Lord's kin. Oof. Faith 18. I could get to Faith 18. And Intelligence 40, so it's primarily... Yeah. I'm surprised by that. I, th I would have thought it would be the other way around, like most yeah. of the but no. Yeah. So it uses two slots. It's a two-slot user, too. Oh, my oh, gosh. I'm, I am picking this up. Absolutely. Are you only one Faith away? Uh, maybe. Of the fingers guide you. One or two. Uh, yeah, one away. A lot of runes away, but... Yeah. Um, that'll be my next level up, then. Is, uh... Is giving myself one more faith. Oh, man, what a wild ride. There's a smaller thing, if you're interested in the smaller thing on, yes. the, on the little... I'm looking at the little checklist, was... There was a comment a while back that... Apparently, Bach was supposed to have dialogue in Lane Dell, and mm. I never encountered it, and I looked into it, and it seems like the trigger for it and for continuing with Bach would be buying buying Radon's chest armor. That's right. Maybe. You mentioned that. Um, I don't know if I have... Uh, which one? Verdun's lion armor. Okay. Yeah, and so whether that's whether you want to spend runes on this or come back later, I think that it, apparently that's something that might work. But I, I'm, I don't know. It, these it, these quests seem like they can be broken if you turn yeah. left before the sun rises <laughs> right. in the wrong day or something. So I don't know. Yeah. Hmm. I'll go forth. And for anyone in the comments who um, hears this and is like, no, the way you get box dialogue is by doing <laughs> X, you know, I think it's, you know, if it's probably okay to, to nudge in that direction, because... Yeah, I'm we're really... trying. We're trying yep. here, but I do kind of want to see what it looks like. Oh my god, look at me. Look at those shoulders. Oh, battle mage. Oh, that's actually kind of, that's kind of badass. I could see if you were doing, like, a big, huge sword or hammer or something kind of build, this would be a very appealing look. Yeah. Actually, I'm curious yeah, some what badass this armor. would look like. Eh. It reminds Ooh, me a poofy. little bit of my starting outfit. I've kind of got double cloaks going on there, which is not ideal. I like my noble's traveling garb. Okay. So let's go see if Bach is going to tell me anything else in Lindell. Oh, 
Hello, friend. Rock the seamster at your service, master. Ready to make adjustments to your garments. I'm sorry? Master, my apologies. Your wardrobe includes the garb of the old demigods, and I'm afraid I can't make adjustments to them. <laughs> my mum told me once that a royal seamster would do them up in a jiffy. Just wait, master. Before long, I'll be that good too. Oh, I can give him the gold sewing needle. I got that ages ago. I what is it again? Like, is it? I forgotten. Let me. Please. Let me look, cause I it's been so long. Key item, I assume. It's gotta be. Starlight. Uh, here. Yeah, sewing needle made of gold. Unique item made to alter demigod attire. One of the tools brought by Radagon when he entered into marriage with Renala and joined the Carrion line. Bok the scene ready to make adjustment. Is that a gift for my undeserving self? A hundred percent. Kindly. But what on earth could it? Oh, what amazing! I've never seen a golden needle. Not in all my life. With a spectacular royal crest to boot, are you certain that this is for me? Oh, I can hardly believe it. Have faith in me, Master. I'll polish my craft enough that I deserve this golden gift. I'll be the golden seamster, Bok. Now I'll be able to sew anything. Even the threads of the demigods. Well, congratulations. Oh my god. What's I have the so barrage of dialogue well, options? <laughs> oh my god. Okay, we'll start at the top. Master, may I ask you something? Would you mind if I called you Lord? I heard that you and the other tarnished seek the throne of the Elden Lord. Well... I know that you will be the one, and you'd make just the manner of kind-hearted lord that I'd wish for. So please, if you would, allow me to call you lord. I mean, if it makes you happy? Sure. You don't say. Thank you. Thank you. My lord. My lord. My lord. <laughs> Be so happy. Elden Lord. I mean, I and guess that's the goal. I bock the seems to remain at your side. Surely she'd be happy for you. Do you think that Mum would be pleased oh. if she knew? <laughs> Absolutely. That I'm as good as any royal seamster now. Oh, it's still not enough. I need to learn how to sew from scratch like her. I was like, who in the world is the she in that question? And then it's his mm. mother. <gasps> adorable. Bok is adorable. It's so cute. He's come a long way from being an infuriating voice in a tree. <laughs> Remember that? Oh my god. Alright, have you ever thought so? My lord, have you ever wished you might be born again? Well, they say that Renala of Rhea Lucaria has the power to help people be reborn. Oh, me? Reborn? Oh, look at me. When you're this ugly, well, being reborn, it would hardly make a difference, I'm afraid. <gasps> I could give him a larval tear. Absolutely, I have plenty, I'm sure. My lord, what's this? Oh. be for my rebirth but these are precious are you certain that it's for me oh. oh my lord how did you know it because you brought it up out of nowhere that i might honor you with a decent appearance 
Oh, but Bok, you're adorable as you are. Oh. Please wait. Uh, I don't... I don't know what the implications of this are. Okay, I'm gonna say it. My lord. It shouldn't take me long. Oh, he's asking me to wait, not me asking him to wait. Oh, thank God. I'll be reborn fresh. I'm so curious what will happen. Like, I think he's fine how he is. Going already, my lord. Please do be safe on your journeys. But he really wants it. And so, therefore, I want it for him. You are a yep. box supporter. I am. You got box back. I, I do. All right, well, let's go back here again. This is a surprisingly renala centric episode. <laughs> I know, right? Oh, my God. Is Bach here? Selen is still here. Hi, Selen. Um, maybe he comes here and then I find him somewhere else. There's no option to fight with Bach or against Bach, so. <laughs> Thank God. <laughs> <laughs> All right. I'll just double check that she doesn't have any dialogue. I see somebody. Is that you, Bach? You might need to find an outfit. Oh, uh, shit. Bach? He's trying for a let me solo her uh, cosplay. <laughs> he just needs the pot hat. <laughs> yep. <laughs> Okay. Oh dear. Okay, let's let's rest. Let's rest. Oh no. Did I get Bach killed? Did did Bach die? Oh no, buddy. Shit. I was just trying to help. I mean, it's, uh, he did make his choice. We, you know, Bernal's creations are always seem kind of short-lived and like the yeah. versions she makes. Or, but he did get his wish. Did seem to I get transformed as he wanted to. Guess. Oh, oh dear. Oh dear. The worst well, thing. Yeah. Is that this is one of those where there was another way to do it. Oh no. And you're gonna kill me, or you're gonna. I think you might. Delete the game when you find out the way, the other option beyond to make it a good giving him the larval ending. tear. Are you ready? Sure. You use the prattling when he starts talking about how ugly Are he is. You, th no way. That says you're, you're beautiful. Beautiful. No yep. fucking way. No <laughs> fucking way. Are you pulling my leg? I am. Not, I swear on oh. all that I find holy. Oh, <laughs> my God. Oh, my God. <laughs> all right. Well, on that note. God these... bless whoever discovered that <laughs> by, like, responding to him by pulling out prattling pate. <laughs> There we go. Sorry, Bach. I'm crying. <laughs> and on that note, I'm out of time today. We'll catch y'all the next time when we head back north with the Giants. Bye. Bye-bye. <laughs>